Hello, I'm Kung Tai Ted. This is a series about strength. Yelling. Uh... And the greatest martial arts fight sequences of all time. We begin with a title called Undefeatable, a 1993 direct-to-video action film directed by the greatest fight choreographer of all time, Godfrey Ho. And where do we know this name? <laughs> You don't look so tough to me. Don't judge a book by its cover. That's right. Godfrey Ho is the man who created the legend. Moving on to Undefeatable, what is most important about this final battle between good and evil is being able to distinguish between good and evil. This is where the movie succeeds. The man with the vigor mullet and the insane Kim Coates dare is obviously our villain. This makes it easier for those of us coming into the movie in the last five minutes. What follows here is called the slow jerk. This is the art of doing a scene in slow motion, even though the scene actually isn't filmed in slow motion. It is easy to spot this by the movement of the hair and the saliva. The slow jerk is useful for street fighting combat when you aren't backed up by your trusty editor. As you can see here, the mullet comes in ultra handy when the tops come off. Now we are able to tell which character is which by the angelic hairstyles. As you may have noticed, yelling is crucial to this scene, which is key when the viewer is drifting in and out, but is still listening to the action going on on screen. With both characters yelling, our sleepy viewer knows full well that no one is dead yet and the fight must go on. The yelling also alerts your fellow sidekick that any time they want to join in would be very much appreciated, and props, like this towel, would be an added bonus. The sidekick's use comes in handy for when your star fighter needs to take a breather, and also because the sidekick is actually a bigger star than the scene's star fighter. For those who don't know, Cynthia Rothrock was the only Cinemax star of the early 90s who didn't consistently take her clothes off. Take notice of the background in this scene. Warehouses are perfect for the cinematic battle, because if you're lucky, you'll find a prop that's better than a towel. Now that our villain has been demolished, there's only one thing to do. Keep watching him, because as long as he's still screaming, he can still put up a fight. Oh, and there's two things left. The other is the inevitable one-liner pun after your enemy has been silenced. Keep an eye out for you, Stingray. But in this case, we have another exception. With two heroes, we shall allow for one extra pun. Yeah. See ya. Until next time, my friends. This is Kung Tai Ted saying, See ya. Keep an eye out for you, Stingray. Yeah. See ya. Huzzah! The fun has been double.